Hi, Jeremy Cohen here with a Make Your Fiddle Swing Minute. Now it's entirely possible that this may take a little bit longer than a minute, but let's get started learning how to produce better tone, improvise, and make your fiddle swing. Hi, Jeremy Cohen here, and this Make Your Fiddle Swing Minute is going to be about the concept of economy of motion. I'm talking about largely the amount of energy expelled in your left hand and in your left hand fingers, the ones that get the notes. Right arm gets the sound, left arm achieves the notes. And what a lot of people tend to do is have what we call flying fingers. They'll play a note and as soon as they're finished playing the note, they will lift the finger off the string. And the point that I want to make is that if you don't need to pick up a finger, I suggest that you leave it down. For example, same scale. I don't need my first, second, or third finger, but I have not moved them away from the fingerboard. So I've kept them down to create economy of motion. Now I need them. I've got to lift the fourth up. I've got to lift the third. I've got to lift the second. In other words, don't lift them until you need to lift them. This playing pattern looks a lot different than something like this. I have a lot of young students that have what I like to call flying fingers. So think about it. If you don't need a finger, leave it down where you've previously played it. And if it's in the way of a note that you need to play, well, definitely you have to pick it up. Okay. But this is whole concept is called economy of motion. It's a concept that really helps you get your left hand relaxed, avoid flying fingers, and a better path towards learning how to play your instrument better. This has been this Make Your Fiddle Swing Minute. I hope you enjoy. Lots to think about. See you soon.